starting today, we're going to be having a 2v2 melee. The, por the purpose of this particular fight is last man standing on the team. We're going to be having Philip the Vicious of Macedonia. We're going to have Colton. Not everyone has names yet. I will, I'll, I'll get them as they go. But some, the Montana team is newer, so you all know. So make sure you cheer on your home people. We have Kyle. This is the Montana team. Daryl. <laughs> so there are Montana. Yeah. Things that are not allowed. You cannot stab. No, wait. You I think that's Salt Lake. I think that's Montana. And there are a couple of joints, such as the bottom of the foot, back of the knee, directly on the neck, and then aiming up and down on the spine. Beside that, they can do anything they want. Are you fighters ready? Are you fighters ready? Yeah, General! Ref, take it away. Your skull. Oh, Alright, that's your 60 seconds. So, where we had you originally put the Let's go, Montana! But my team is leaving. Get him, Golden! There we go. They still gotta win one more. 
Remember, open in one corner. I'm going to give him another 60 seconds so that he can breathe. Remember, on top of everything else that I said, there's a wildfire going on in the city of Montana. He's got the building over Even though it may not be as apparent, if you kind of look up towards the sky, as you can see a bit of haze. As that gets into your lungs while you're fighting, it's almost like trying to smoke while doing an aerobic activity. But yeah, no, so he'll be opening up another one. It'll be bigger, actually, when it comes to the it'll be bigger. Good. And then we'll, be, we'll keep moving out. They're so popular. We're not gonna do we're not gonna do a whitefish just because the people that run whitefish hate calling it. Nineteen seconds left, fighters, catch your breath. Get ready for the next round. Exactly. So we already know that. Good. Which is why we're going to see Paul. So we're it's coming. I'm I'm excited for you. I gave it to him. Oh, yeah. In our sport, we do do duel. Can I see that knife? Similar to Olympic fencing, where you. Can I see your knife? It's. It's. You guys puking over here. Who? Oh, fighters. You bought one of the fighters? Yeah. Careful, I took the thing off. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Why don't you show off that weapon, everybody, Troy? Yeah. You like it? Yeah. Ow. Okay, baby. It acts very much like a large machine. You know the sides are sharp. Yeah, I tried to get an axe. So, at least right now, and I'm actually pretty excited to get in there. I think I'm going to fight right now. Well, I mean, technically, they're required to sell the gold. And you can fix it. Yeah, you can sharpen it. Yep. But yeah. Yeah. 
And so what happened to the guy over there? He had bad asthma and he couldn't breathe. Yeah, it's coming Excuse me. Up. What? Crazy costumes. <laughs> that costume looks heavy. Oh. Hot and heavy. I mean, they're in there with metal. They're cooking inside. But then again, they're actually going back to when the I know. They were doing it in Scotland and England, is where it's called. Yep. Yep. Hello, everybody. Yeah! yeah. So I got really bad asthma. Ah. Sometimes that does not mix well with dust on the ground, smoke in the air. But we're here! Yeah. Alright, so next up, we have Trey in Mongolian armor. European continent. Trey, however, chose the uh, Mongol army uh, armor there. It's a little bit different, a lot more cloth. That's because oftentimes they fight in the desert. And if you've ever touched hot cement in the summer, it gets hot. Guess what? Armor does the same thing. So they'll cover all of their armor in cloth so that it doesn't absorb as much of the sun. So that is one of the big differences between Mongolian armor and European. You'll see the Europeans as well, right? Like my chest piece here. It's called a brigadine. It's metal underneath or studded to leather. Okay? So next we have Austin. About 10 more minutes. Austin, are you fighting? Yes, sir. All right. 10 more minutes. I'm hot. Woo! talking in the beginning the with the blue? Yeah. He was the yeah. One. He's the one that got so sick. Trey, he actually has been fighting for less than a year. He's a little bit on the new side. What they're going to be doing for you is a, a pro fight. That's what we call it. We call it. Essentially, it's a melee, just like you saw, except one-on-one -on -one versus being with a team. Okay? So, I'm going to let you see a little bit what it is, but the same rules apply. Okay, I'll turn it over to you. Yeah, I'm going to wait all out on the 
Do we have somebody wants to switch in for Austin? Uh, they have to Austin's exhausted. Yeah, he went off. Switch out. There we go. So, in case you haven't been able to tell, they're tired. Yeah. They're tired. There's people in every chair. Stuff in every chair, guys. Austin's going to take a break. Woo! 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 Austin's getting out. Austin. No, that's Trey. That's Trey. Austin's getting switched out. He's too hot. Guy coming in is from Montana. 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 He jumped right to his feet and said, Nobody is going to be cutting my arm. Yeah. Yeah. Nobody's yeah. cutting my wedding yeah. ring off. Yeah. Right? With an axe in his skull. Uh -huh. <laughs> okay, so this guy was awesome. Yeah. I like the Crusader outfit. Yeah. the safety feature outfit. Yeah. the signing strap. He was completely fine. This, right. the, in the x rays, you could actually see where the skull fractured and the, the, uh, the axe went a little bit embedded in there, and he loved to show off those pictures. Now you know a little bit, we always have to make sure that our fighters have their Simon strap on before they get in the list because of that. So, without further ado, here is Trey. I don't know. For the head. Let's go! Kyle! 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 Alright, I'm gonna hit it. 
I'm hot. Sherry, we're gonna hit it. I'm really hot. Yeah, I am. <laughs> okay. All right. Bye. I'll do like maybe a twin shield one. Okay. Hey, you're good. So it's a little bit different than what you've seen before. Before the opponent is to bring, or the, the objective is to bring your opponent to the ground. In this particular fight, what you're going to see is a counted point duel. Essentially, it's how many shots can you hit on your opponent in one minute uh, to, in order to win. So, as a result, give me a second here. I'm going to give my gauntlets on and a shield, and uh, we'll see you out there in just a
see that my eyebrow is bleeding now? Yeah. You said you wanted blood! Yeah. We gave you blood! <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. We're going to be moving into our last fight now. It's going to be back to the melees, the team fights. Participating in this. Yeah. 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 
We're going to have Gerald and Colton as well. And they're going to be coming in with something to prove. We're getting the last weapons on. And I can tell you guys, after getting orthopedic surgery, after getting orthopedic surgery, uh, getting a five inch plate and six screws put into my arm to fight again, I can tell you I'm tired. <laughs> uh, I appreciate you sticking with me. I tried to show off at least a little bit of my skill, even though I can't bring the power today. Unfortunately, you know, after they cut you open and put an armor inside your body, it takes a little longer to you. All right, do we have our last fighters ready? Oh, you want to go two? Yeah. Oh, thank you. It's nasty. Keep it cradled on the shoulder until you're ready. Kyle's going to be dueling over here, everybody. All right, this is Colton entering the list. Let's hear it. Joel entering the list. And Kyle bringing the dude in with the mace and the hand and silver. Fighters. Formulate your plan. Have acknowledgement to the ref. And here they go! One of the things about free for alls is that. see that his foot stepped on a little bit of that hay and it just came right out from underneath him which was unfortunate but the thing is is that field hazards are absolutely part of the match if someone else has fallen on the field and you push them over that person that's actually one of the main ways to be able to fight in our league catching the breather getting the water and they're going to be right back at it shortly This is going to be our very last round, everyone, okay? All right, guys. Woo! And then at 3.45 again. Yeah, Kyle figuring out that drill building is something that you do in anime and movies, not in real life. <laughs> Fighters, get those heads, get those gloves, and get those weapons. Can someone have Gerald over here? Make sure his head gets on right. Just make sure everything's on. All right, he's good. All right, last round for the for this particular part of the day. Let's hear it for everybody's favorite fighters once again. Go, go, go. Oh, 
Looks like they moved the fighting arena so far. It popped out. Yes, but also, we're also it's still going though. Real. We're going to be finishing this round shortly. Same exact yeah, you're, you're okay. Yeah, yeah. And let's make sure that weapon gets off the middle of the ground and gets back in Colton's hands. Yeah, take that one out of the bottom and put it in the top. It's not funny. A little bit. No. <laughs> all right. I, I don't know about all this, guys. I think I might see some uh, some strategizing outside the round. There's beer in that. Come on, Kyle. trying to take you out. Not anymore. Kyle's the powerful fight one on one. Yeah, it's very important that our arena stays together because if they get a charge, those uh, two nice children over there would be... <laughs> <laughs> All right, we'll use them as a safety rail for the next round. Safety rail. <laughs> All right, guys, it's time. Let's get to your spots. Remember guys, you feel how hot it is yourself. Take away some of your breathing. Add a hundred pounds of armor. Let's make sure they hear it so that they can enjoy themselves. City Crusaders, hashtag Salt Lake City Crusaders on Instagram, YouTube, right, and Facebook. The and then we have your team, the Montana Summit. Check them out on, on social media as well. 